um, you know, like I said, we do everything we can to protect the privacy of customers. But again, we spend a lot of time with privacy experts. And it was really ingrained in me that, um, or hammered into me, that privacy doesn't mean not sharing. And that privacy actually means choice. And that people will say, like, I want to have the choice to say, no one sees my data. Or I want to have the choice to say, all my family sees my data. Or make it public. That we want to enable choice. And we need to do everything we can to respect your choice. I don't want to share it with anyone. And we need to respect that. But I also need to respect your choice of saying, I want to share it with my whole family. And so we've enabled those kinds of sharing abilities um, with all of our customers. In terms of the research, um, we do consent. We ask our customers if they want to consent for research. So it's an opt-in. Over 85% of our customers today are, in fact, opting in. Um, and what we find is similar to this sort of goodwill nature of Susan G. Komen, like people want to people want to help. You know, there's no such thing as a healthy person. Like everyone has something. Everyone has allergies or migraines or I have Hashimoto's. Like everyone has something. And so um, we all want to help each other, and we can all be empathetic to this fact that, like, you know, like my, you know, one of my good friends has cancer. Like I, I'm like everyone has a story. Everyone has a friend who has something. You've all seen other people suffer. And we want to help. 